And one other thing that I feel like I should mention on this subject is the sunk cost fallacy. When I was thinking about switching from the Apple Watch to the A11, I thought, I've bought this, I've bought this 400 pound watch. Why would I not wear it? And this is a prime example of the sunk cost fallacy. Just because I've invested some money in a piece of technology, which I thought would benefit my life. If it isn't actually benefiting my life in the way that I thought it would, the only reason to keep wearing it is because I've spent the money on it. And that is the sunk cost fallacy. Just because you've invested some money into something, if that thing is no longer benefiting you or will not benefit you, it's perfectly all right to say goodbye to that. The same can be said, you know, if you bought tickets to an event and then the day of the event you decide you're not feeling 100% and you'd rather stay home, it's fine to not go to that event. It's okay to lose that money as long as what you're actually deciding to do benefits you. Thank you for watching. I hope that you got something from this video. You can find my website at www.olirossaphoto.com. You can follow me on Instagram at olirossaphoto, Twitter at Ollie Rosser. Again, thank you for watching. I hope you all have a great day and I'll speak to you next time.